I chose to come to Shenzhen because I wanted to change things completely, take it completely 180 degrees, like change everything that's possibly can be changed. And Asia was the perfect place to do that. And I started looking into China and I saw a, a small promising city in the south of China called Shenzhen. So that's how I got here. I'm currently in a video production business. Shenzhen has a lot of startups almost every day. Many people try to develop new technologies and, and make new things, so it's a perfect place to be. But even if you produce that thing in a perfectly possible way, but the, the main general idea of why you're doing this is missing, then it's kind of pointless. So I really do believe that outside of an actual commercial, you need to have this core belief and why you're doing your business and what you're trying to accomplish. And even if that goal is not realistic, you need to believe that you want to change the world with that. You, you're, you're working for a cause bigger than yourself. Sometimes we organize events and it's, it's really fascinating because um, maybe some people think that only the, the special talented people can write really good stories. But to be honest, there is a structure to it. So you can turn any story into an interesting story if you give it a structure. If you use all of these elements that you can use. I naturally, I, I enjoy sharing. I enjoy sharing knowledge. I like to see people learn new things. It's exciting when, when you meet somebody who is eager and happy to learn. It's like they're not even, they're not asking you to tell them, but with their attitude of happy to learn, you just feel like sharing and the knowledge is flowing out of you. Because China is such a different place from the rest of the world. I guess my favorite thing about living in Shenzhen is that you always meet somebody really super talented or super creative, super crazy in something. Like you never meet just simple people. So this international community is just, it's really great. Uh, the special thing about uh, Shenzhen Special Economic Zone is that uh, it's really green. It's, it's human psychology. When you live in a place, it's, it's hard to appreciate it. A friend of mine came uh, to Shenzhen from Shanghai a couple of days ago, and he keeps saying how green Shenzhen is. And I'm, I look around and I think, yeah, it is really green. What I also like about Shenzhen is that it's just how efficient public services are so fast. It was impressive to me. Right now, the way people, uh, media teams find clients is very chaotic. I guess what I would like to see down the line in the video production industry in Shenzhen is having uh, unions, just like in Canada or America, where if you join the union, you gain this membership status and you are protected by that union. And also that union has uh, qualification requirements. You need to have this amount of hours, this, this amount of experience, so once you're in the union, like, it's a guarantee that you're a real professional.